Well, guys, it's been great doing marriage prep with you. I hope it's been helpful, even though it's had to be over Zoom. And I'm looking forward to the wedding. Have a good one. We'll start off with a little workout. We may not have public mass, but we can still have muscle mass. Ha <laughs> ha. I'm sorry. But with the gym closed, we've got to get a little bit creative. Nah, I'm kidding. After a workout, I like to make a quick protein shake. Get some of these berries in there. A little dehydrated peanut butter. Protein powder. Milk. Well, we've got all the ingredients in there. While I do this, I do want to let you guys know I have some pretty big news. It might come as a shock to a lot of y'all, and I don't even know if this is the best place to say this, but after a lot of prayer and discernment, I've decided to... I know it's pretty crazy. I kind of can't believe it either, but I just really feel like... So if you could just keep me in your prayers. In my last video, my baby beard was just getting its start in the world. It had a bright future and an optimistic outlook. And now, a couple weeks later, we can see it is obviously hopeless. Us priests have actually stayed really busy during the shutdown. We've had a lot of Zoom staff meetings. Whoa, we're running a little bit late here, but we're good. We're good. Yeah, okay. What's up, everybody? <laughs> no, I did not just wake up. I've been up since like five. In my opinion, we've ascertained proximity from the personification of redundant axioms presupposed upon tautological repetitions and enhanced our paradoxical paradigms via redundant innovations. But overall, I think vacation Bible school went well. I've had a lot of personal meetings over Zoom for things like marriage prep and spiritual direction. You said this was the youth ministry meeting? Okay, I'm good, I'm ready. You said this was the Knights of Columbus meeting? Okay, I'm good, I'm good, I got you. You said this was the finance council meeting? Okay, I got you. This is my personal assistant. He's gonna take notes on the meeting and he'll let me know what you guys talked about. Thanks. It's true that a lot has changed. It's kind of sad to look at the bulletin board. So much of the stuff has been canceled. Men's conference, canceled. Trivia night, canceled. Night's day, canceled. But here's something that hasn't been canceled. COVID-19. I don't know what happened, but since we stopped having public mass, this random pair of shoes has been sitting in the front row of the church, undisturbed. So when I'm saying mass, I have an empty church and a random pair of shoes staring back at me. I guess some lady walked out of here barefoot. I'm not sure why she would have left a perfectly good pair of shoes. I mean, they're not Crocs. But we've live streamed a lot of liturgies, like masses and adoration hours. And we've live streamed some things that definitely aren't liturgies. I smell it already. <laughs> His name is literally called Stinky Tofu. <laughs> We got him. <laughs> I'm thankful we've been able to continue to minister online, but I am kind of tired of seeing an empty church. After a long day in quarantine, I sometimes like to take a little cruise around the neighborhood and just hope I see another human being.